In this video, I'm going to talk about using JTAG to program the uh, ECU um, compared to the boot assistant mode. The configuration, the, these pins are still needed. Uh, if you do not sort those two wires, the JTAG is uh, sometimes does not work quite well. So in the boot mode, same configuration as the other one. The pinout of the here is the same as the E78 and uh, the ground pin, and then this is the TDO, JCOM, then TMS, and then the TDI and uh, the TSK. So we plug in here, and then we power on the ECU. In the software, we need to go to the configuration, and uh, we need to select the JTAG, uh, this is PowerPC, and there is ECU E92. We can click OK. Now this shadow has the uh, been modified. This one originally had the censorship as well as the password. The censorship word has the, the JTAG disabled. I have modified the, the shadow using the, the CAM bus to uh, modify it so we can enable the JTAG. However, the password is still needed. In here, we can load the existing shadow from the canvas, and then we can say from shadow. We also need to check this box, say password, and make sure power on, and then we can hit, hit detect. And this is the everything. Now we can do a read like we do in the canvas, but this one, this time is much, much, much faster. So let's go to the flash, and we can read. So four megabyte of flash takes about six seconds. I do not need to fast forward. We can do one more time. Yeah, so this is a good read. I'm going to save it. And uh, since I already have, so save it. Now I'm going to erase the flash. Okay, I'm erasing the entire flash. I'm going to make sure it's if it's blank or not and blank check it. So this is, ECU is completely erased. Now I'm power cycle it. And uh, so this thing is bricked normally. But if we sorted boot mode and the JTAG, you can see how fast we can recover it. So now I'm going to power on. And I'm going to check. Now let's load the flash. We just loaded uh, here. And we click this button to program it. The erase time is the same as the regular mode. I just uh, to be lazy and uh, click this button to uh, do the program and erase program and uh, verify. When we do the boot assistant mode, the programming takes um, very long because of the uh, reading clock speed is at 200 kilohertz. The JTAG clock now is at 80 megahertz. So it's way, way, way faster. So the read speed is about 600 kilobyte per second, and the programming time should be around 100 kilobyte per second. So this will take you about 30 to 40 seconds to program. But the erase time cannot be saved. The erase takes more time than the program itself. Okay, erase. So now you see the programming at the speed of 120 kilobyte, 150, and the four megabytes divided by 100 will be 40 seconds. And
So programming takes 34 seconds and erase takes one minute and 10 seconds, but the verification only takes six seconds. So if you do have a bricked ECU and you do not want to waste time on the, uh, the canvas uh, band mode recovery, then JTAG is an option to um, quickly recover your ECU.